The war in Ukraine, where Ukrainian forces launched one of its deadliest ever missile strikes on New Year's Day, leveling a building housing Russian soldiers. The two sides disagree on the number killed, but both call it a massive attack. Here's CBS's Ian Lee. These smoldering ruins are all that's left of a Russian base, used to house troops and store weapons in the city of Makivka. Ukrainian HIMARS rockets, like those seen here, landed shortly after midnight on Sunday. Russia claims at least 63 soldiers died, while Ukraine says as many as 400 were killed. It capped off a deadly New Year's weekend. Russia launched dozens of drones and missiles at Ukrainian cities and infrastructure, plunging parts of the country into darkness yet again. One killed a woman in Kyiv. Her father-in-law picked through what remains of her house. What can I say? They are beasts and they're not humans, he says. Another hit a children's hospital in Kherson. Fortunately, no one was injured. But in Ukraine, no one is too young to become a victim of war. After that deadly Ukrainian attack in Makivka, many brace for what they believe will be a ruthless Russian response. JB? Ian Lee, thank you.